work besties have you ever wondered what the salary difference looks like from country to country for very similar or let's call it the same job because I have and so I looked into a few things and I'm going to share them with you because I found it quite interesting so we've picked a handful of jobs from police officers to nurses to teachers to HR managers to electricians and we looked up basically the country's average salary range for a job like that and also what the average cost of living and when we talk about cost of living there are so many factors that go into it basically went on to different sites that was like, if I wanted to immigrate to this country, what's the average cost of living? And that's where I kind of pulled this data from. So keep that in mind, cost of living varies. I know where I live in Canada can vary significantly depending on where you live. And so something to bear in mind, we just have general figures to kind of compare so you could see where that salary would fit within the cost of living in that country, cool? Cool, let's get started. First job we have is a police officer. And the first country would be Australia, which that, don't judge me. I know that's not the accent for it, but anyways, would be just over $72,000. And these are all US dollars. I tried to make it as consistent as possible across the board. So 72K US, and then annual cost of living falls around 28,000 US. In Brazil, average cost of living being 10 to 15K, and a police officer would make about 10,000. So that's barely enough to cover the basics. In Canada, average cost of living is around 33,000 US dollars. And the average police officer position makes about 92, just over $92,000. Now we've got France. So France average cost of living, I found to be $23,000 US roughly, and $40,000 was the average salary for a police officer. India, the average cost of living was between six and 10,000 US dollars. Six to 10 is kind of the range I found. And a police officer would earn about 7,000 US dollars annually. In Indonesia, cost of living can vary from eight to $12,000 US. And a police officer would make about $5,000 US a year. In Japan, average cost of living is around $30,000 and a police officer average salary is about $45,000. In the United States, cost of living is about $38,000 a year. Again, the states is huge and I know it can vary, very, very, it can vary quite, brain glitch. It can vary quite a lot depending on what state you live. Its average was $38,000 and the police officer in the states would make just over $83,000 US. Wow, Canada topped that list. That's interesting. All right, now on to nurses. In Australia, $56,000 average salary. Brazil, $8,000. Canada, $70,000. France, $40,000. India, $6,000. Indonesia, $4,000. Japan, $45,000. And in the U.S., about $75,000. So U.S. topped the list for that one for nurses. But looking at this, I'm like, that's, that's still a low salary considering all that nurses do for us. Teachers. So the average salary in Australia for a teacher is $65,000. The average salary for a teacher in Brazil is $20,000, which is a lot higher than nurses in Brazil. That's interesting. And then in Canada, it's anywhere from 60 to $100,000. There's like a pretty big range there. France averages about $45,000. India, about $10,000 annual salary. Indonesia, same thing, $10,000. $50,000 in Japan. And the US is about $63,000. Moving on to tech sales. And a lot of tech sales are commissioned. And I know that there is probably a massive range. Actually, we have a range for every single one, but this is just like the average that we saw. I'm sure it can go much higher. Australia, between 60 and 100K. Brazil, 30 to 60K. For Canada, 60 to 110K. France, 50 to $85,000. India, between 20 and 45K. Indonesia, 15 to $35,000. Japan, 50 to $90,000. And in the US, anywhere from 70 to $120,000. Though I feel like that definitely goes a bit higher from people I've talked to. Business analyst. That's actually a fun fact where I started my career as a little BA. 
Um, Australia, 85,000. Brazil, 25,000. Canada, 75,000. That's not what I started at. <laughs> France, 60,000. India, 12,000. Indonesia, 15,000. Japan, 70,000. And in the US, about 85,000. Sales managers. Keep in mind, of course, this can vary ton by industry, but in Australia, it was about 110K. That's pretty high. And then Brazil, 40,000. 90,000 for Canada. France, 70,000. India, 20,000. Indonesia, 25,000. Japan, 85,000. And in the US, 120,000. An IT technician. Australia, 65,000 a year. Brazil, 22,000. Canada, 55,000. France, 45,000. India, 10,000. Indonesia, 12,000. Japan, 55,000. And US, 60,000. All right, a few different countries for these ones. So we've got an HR manager in Canada on average would make about $75,000. In the US, about $82,000. In Brazil, about $27,000. France, around 50K. In India, just under 8,000 was the average. In the Philippines, about 11,000. Australia, about $86,000 US. And Indonesia, about 10K. An electrician. The trades are so underrated. I was looking up different trades. Some trades are extremely lucrative, let me tell you. So an electrician in Canada, on average, would make about $56,000 US. In the United States, about $64,000. And I feel like this is one too where it can vary so greatly depending on where you're working as an electrician. This is just taking general country averages. In Brazil, about $15,000 US. In France, $52,000 US. In India, $3,000 US. That is low. Philippines, $4,000 US. Also very low. Australia, about $62,000. And in Indonesia, about $18,000 US. I always find it interesting just reading the different salaries available for positions that are arguably the same, like you'd be doing kind of the same job description, the same kind of work um, in country to country, and then comparing that to cost of living. It makes me go, huh, I wonder if I could do my job from a different country that may be more aligned with what I enjoy in life and saves me money in the long term. Not that I don't adore Canada, because it, it's a pretty cool spot to be, but I, I just look at some of these and I'm like, huh, interesting. Kona, don't sit on her, okay. Uh, one of my dogs just sits on my other dog all the time. And now that we're entering a season that's a little more chilly, it's like very frequent, like an hourly event. And then, oh yeah, she is sitting on you. She just woke up and realized, but it's warm. So she says, I'm okay with it. I don't know what else to tell you about this. I just, I thought it was interesting. And maybe you thought it was interesting too. Maybe you didn't, that's also fine. Well, that's all I had for you today, Work Bessies. I am gonna stop staring at this spreadsheet because it's a lot of numbers. And my brain is not digging. I'm not an Excel girly. I appreciate Excel. It exhausts me if I'm gonna be honest, but now my brain isn't even working. Okay, I should just go before. I should take a break is what I should go do. Thank you for being here as always, and I'll see you in the next video, Work Bestie. Toodaloo.